One of the big fears, of course, is that students are just going to rely on this technology and that they will not do some authentic writing. So here's a quote about plagiarism. And I like it I just kind of here to, to read it. It says, if you want to make students not plagiarize, or in this case, not use things like ChatGPT, you simply need students that are passionate about their assignments, are confident in their skills, and have the resources to complete the task that they are given. So. I'm gonna leave you with a lot of different little resources. So I'm just gonna skip through here. I want you to think about, you know, if we're constantly giving students just that five paragraph essay or only the argumentative essay, that a lot of times they don't wanna turn and do these assignments. They're not feeling quite connected to the topics. I want you to think about their world. How are they expressing their thoughts? And one of the ways is social media, text messages, blogging and blogging, YouTube videos, TikTok, right? Um, posting on blogs and so forth. So they know they can get their words out. And sometimes in our classroom, if they feel they're just writing an essay for one person, for the teacher, they don't feel as connected. And so how can we maybe amplify their voice in different ways where it's not always so restricted? So opening up a little bit. So we're gonna be showing you how you can use ChatGPT to kind of expand that repertoire of writing. All right, I'm gonna leave this for you to explore. All of these are hyperlinks. This is if you do not wanna bring in chat GPT and you want kids to work on that writing process. These are all different ways that you can get students to write. And I'm not saying just bring out paper and pen where hopefully nobody leaves here thinking we're just gonna ban the internet or stop using computers. Don't do that, right? We don't wanna go that way. We need to prepare them for that future and that future does include lots of technology. And so a lot more collaborative writing or a lot more discussion based uh, can really get that, that type of writing skills out. Okay, uh, and finally, I'm gonna leave you with this. This is from Kelly Gallagher. I was at, again, at this wonderful PD conference where they talked about writing and why students might not wanna write, right? And why they resort to things like this. And one of the best quotes I heard was the best writing teacher is writing. Get them to write not just write to show them what they know, not just to summarize the book, not just to you know answer that prompt, but to write out of their heart. And so here's a Padlet and the link is down below of just so many resources of getting kids to just write quick writes and journal writing and passionate writing. And so again, that's one of the best ways to get students to find their voice and want to publish what they have to say. Okay, so that's pretty much my little part, I'm gonna pass